How's it going, everybody? It is your boy, Ringo Flats, back again with more of the Room 3. And uh, we continue our quest. Our quest for the Null. I need more Glorb, but we can't five or find any more Glorb, you know what I'm saying? I forget that we've got, we've got some little instruments here now that we can do stuff with. Probably not in this building. But we can definitely do stuff with it. Okay. Add another plindle to the board. Much dance. Go, 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 go! You chose that one, you couldn't like line them up for Oh, okay, there we go. Very nice. A telescope. An optical device. Oh man, is that 8 pin? It's 10 pin, bro. Okay. Don't know what that goes to. This is the same note we read, or does he leave me a new one each time I've been reading? Oh, yeah, no, he has. Optical device. Look like you fit right there. I assume we're trying to hit it towards the center. Eventually got there. See if, if any tentacle horrors open up this door. No, and it's not like a bougie hallway back here this time. A greenhouse level? That'd be pretty cool. Alright, here's our note. See what the craftsman has to say this time. Another test passed with all colors flying, and now the time truly is at hand. I promised you answers, and answers you shall have. Every soul is unique, and so must be every trap that snares it. An altar of belief, a tome of answers, a crypt of terrors. For A.S., his box full of demons, knowledge, power, sight beyond sight, all lies, all just bait in the trap. This house was to be yours had you failed, but you walked free of it as you have all the rest. I am certain now that you are the one I have sought, the one who will find the center of the labyrinth, the one who will walk free of this very realm, the craftsman. Yeah, and I'm sure you're an asshole, brother. <laughs> Well, I gotta be careful what I say. There's like new YouTube rules. <laughs> rules. Well, I don't get monetized anyway, so does it really matter? This this becomes my first video to like super explode, and I don't get anything from it. I wouldn't care. I would care more that I it super exploded than anything. There is something embedded in this tree. You you do be right. There's a latch lock in the dial in place. August 7th. 
My fate rests in a terrible paradox. I had need to trap a soul of great brilliance, but for them to exhibit the brilliance I seek, they must surely also see the trap. The outcome is balanced on a racist edge. They yearn for the source of the null, just as I have. I can feel the longing. It must blind them to their fate. Is it blind or bind them to their fate? I don't know. I also wonder on that record. I hope we can figure out what this stuff do. I want to listen to music. Ooh. <gasps> or does our box fit on here? It does fit on here. Yay. Goodbye. Oh, what the hell is this? Oh. Okay, that's pretty cool, actually. Ball. Oh. Do we need a specific shape? I don't know. It's inactive. Okay. Well, now we know we have a machine that can change that shape, so if we find anything that needs that shape, all we must do is come back. Should I keep that on me for now, the the gorb? There's some cooler shapes, though. I want to see it do some other shapes. If I can. Give me a new shape. Yes. <laughs> Yeah, I want to see this thing. Exactly what I wanted. Thank you. It's a metal object indeed. The freaking jack. Oh, lantern. Dead at that? I'm sorry. I shouldn't, I shouldn't make jokes like that. Okay. What do we gotta do here this time? Um. I see. Oh, that's still not really help. Oh, okay. I don't know how that one works. Also, was there like Atari arrows? <laughs> on this thing? I, get, I don't know. Maybe that's a, that helps you do it with the puzzle. Water wheel. Oh yeah, aren't these all the things we saw on that little tiny, like, the board in the first episode? I do believe so. I just like this little machine. So we need to watch out for some little crystals and stuff like that. Is there anything specific for this right now? Same old, same old. <laughs> That's the way to do it. I don't think we should be releasing these things into the world, man. Okay. 
Is there a water wheel? What are we in? Whoa. Automaton. Alright, first thing we do, we read the scroll. Here you arrive at the birthplace of my enterprise and your final lesson. Here is where I began crafting my masterworks, and where you shall learn to do likewise. That which you seek is contained in the box on the table here. Accessing it will require the mastery of many tools. The first set of keys you will have to make yourself, but the final one is held ready for you. The Craftsman. A leather case. Kindling. I saw some over there that looked like it could hold fire. Am I missing parts? I'm probably missing parts. Okay. So. There's a lot to take in in this one. A key. I don't know what that means. Got some hot embers over here. That is a strange looking metal tile. I won't fault you for that one. A door. No way of turning it. Fun. Uh, kindling. This looks like a forge or something like that. Forge something, this is gonna be sick. Let's try the Atama arm. He's holding something. I think he's missing components. He's missing like a cam system, I guess. A key and a lock. Splindle. That is what that is. Can we open that? Oh, we can't open that. So I kind of looks like something we've already messed with over here. This. I see what we must do. Oh, well. I thought I saw. Maybe this one. It'll be held in place by something. Because look, the lock looks different. Okay. Can we go over there and flip that? <laughs> Yes. I'm not going to say it's a dumb design, I'm just, I mean, just, you know, it's definitely a way to open a door.
Is that a pawn? Actually, I saw that pattern on that freaking pyramid in the center. Yep, it is held in place. Is that a lathe? Ye olden lathe? Now we can get that bag to come through. My god. Well, let's do what we know we can do. And bring this satchel into the room. Oh, arrive, my child. something on the table there is it is a chess piece does it have that same pattern on the bottom it does are we gonna play freaking 3d chess oh I see we have to put one in we have to put both pieces in I do believe I guess I've said, that is what we were supposed to do because the question mark is really. I didn't look at this thing too much. I don't know if I like this one. Okay. Reset. Okay. You go here. You have to go here. You go ahead and move you over. Okay, I think I see, I see, I see. We got it, we got it. Nice. A metal casting. Hey, I know where this thing went. Put this baby on here. You can power one bulb.
we can power something. We're powering this, baby. Oh god. It's a golden bar. That's good. Probably gets put over here. Shoot dust everywhere, just ugh. Well, we've got riches now, and that's the most important thing. Wait, what? What'd it say? This peg must be here for a reason. Yeah, we'll probably try to figure that out, a hole. When you, you, when you want to, you want, you. Oh. A flint. Okay, now let's see if we can light this baby up and start melting. Start melting some tinder. That coal burning, baby. Let's get this baby going. Well, we don't know if that's the right pattern. Maybe I should <laughs> figure it out for the key. That would be burning my freaking hand off. Okay. And not the right key. We have to see wh which keyhole is open. This one down here. Okay, it needs to be three bars, a circle, and a fish. Three bars, circle, and a fish. Three bars, circle, fish. There's only one direction of fish, yes. Yes, okay, fish. We gotta load this key back in. Reforger. It's cool though, we get to make our own freaking keys. Put Z key in. I'm not sure exactly what that means, but... Huh. Like over here? Does it go somewhere? It's got two little eyes.
let's look around and find a place for it. It could be over here in this room. I guess it could be the lathe, but we don't have anything to power the lathe, so. Oh, uh, maybe it's the freaking hand. Maybe it's the freaking automaton hand. We haven't even messed with that thing yet. It's got gold part pieces, ye. Hey, go, asshole. Damn it, I need to stop cussing. <laughs> I don't think it's that. little eyes. Oh. There we go. Grab it. Oh my god. Okay. Can I not grab it? Of course that's the way it needs to go down. Mechanical disc. Whatever this is. Oh, it's a slide puzzle. circle one over here we can power now. Nice. Let's go back in here. We're spinning this. Does this mechanism have anything to do with this over here? Something's not right. Yeah, we're definitely missing something. Something's not right. It better be right. Okay, let's read what they have to say. The disc. Okay. Oh! I see. Didn't have teeth. I wouldn't have done that. <laughs> I don't think I would have figured that out. Uh, I probably at some point would have, but thank lord there's hints. Nice. Go, 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 go. I see you under a tapeworm. Tapeworm, grab it. 
Oh, I thought it could be a nice tapeworm to eat. Can you go on here? Okay, no, okay. So we need to turn on the lathe to get the piece out of the lathe. That don't make no sense, but game logic. Okay. Aww. Chimney. trying to make a specific shape ah too bad. A new keyhole. Okay. Double fork, triple fork. Double fork, triple fork. Circle. Circle, two dashes. Double fork, triple fork. Oh, we're missing something. Well, we can do the two dashes at least. Does open up an important question. Where do we find that? Mm. See what Mr. Hint has to say. I moved the iron slider in the box into the bar open. There's two ways the slider can go. Do you want this? See that. Well, there we go then. Loads the key up. Load her up in there. Get pumped. Go, 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 go. in the forge. I'm done with you. Get out of here. Okay. Slot the key in. And twist. Ha 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 ha. Puzzle.
It's like a Rubik's Cube, but not that difficult. <laughs> yellow gemstone and the green gemstone so we need to flip it this way flip it flip it get her in there boy Might this little red gemstone go? Have anything to do with the automaton? Probably not, no. <laughs> okay, it's just a little button. Probably not to do anything, anything over there. We cut this gym in half. Can we lathe this gym? Can we set this gym like up in here? We can. Okay. E, triangle, same thing we already have on the bottom. So E, triangle, thing we already have on the bottom. Go, go, go. Mess with the water. Sick. Into the eye of Osiris. I keep saying the eye of Osiris. I don't, I don't even know what that is. I, I think it's something to do with Egyptian, but I just know it from Iron Maiden song. Into the eye of Osiris. too bad. I think that could have been a lot worse. We could have got a lot more jumbled, but we didn't. That's what matters. <clears throat> I see. A lot of load we're putting on this thing, but I think it'll be okay. A new room. So there's like things that look like they could be peg 
pegs for a peg hole. Well, then why'd y'all put it there? Oh, you doubt it'll be useful, hey? Well, we do have a lathe, dude. The lathe, the new handle. A piece of wood. I've used the lathe before. Not for wood. I've only used a lathe for uh, brake discs, but... Both two types of lathe, on the car and off the car lathe. Very cool machines, very scary machines though. I once saw a video of a poor Russian dude getting sucked into a lathe. It's terrible. Don't look that up. Oh, it's too long to fit in there. We gotta use both the tools. It's not broken, it's splintered. There's a difference. Are we sure we're not gonna make a chess piece out of it? Thank you, Mr. Light. A lathed piece of wood. I thought it said a lathered piece of wood. It's like lathered and what? We literally just pulled the what? What did I just unknowingly touch? Okay. I see. We gotta go look at the hand itself. It's got diagrams on it. Okay. Triangle, square, weird L things. Okay. Triangle. Square, weird all things. Thank you. What is this magic? Okay. Stretch it, it's on what? It's on two, yeah. Guess not. There we go. It looked like on the diagram it was on if you're going from top to bottom, too, but I guess it doesn't matter. We got it out. Thank you, Mr. Hand. Why does this piece swivel, but these two don't? Okay. Um, I assume it has something to do with this over here. Yes, it does look like it can fit on here. Oh, I see. It's kind of cool. Put it on this way. And then this one, we need to line all four of the holes up, which they are. 
That's sick. <gasps> the Glorb. Oh. Uh. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Ah. Okay. Uh, praise is due. You mastered the sinister machinery of the forge with aplomb. Let the splinters on your fingertips be a reminder of how far you've come. Well, thank you all for watching. If you like this episode, be sure and hit that like button. And if you really liked it, be sure and hit that subscribe button. You can find my Instagram down in the description below. And with that, have a good day.